Hello beautiful people. Today it's a very lovely day. So I've taken my kids out to the Canning River Reserve. So the spot where we're at is in Ferndale um, and we're going to walk over the Kent Street Weir to get to, um, I think we'll end up in Wilson and there's like a, a cafe on the river there and I'll probably get myself a cuppa or a smoothie or something. There are lots of beautiful birds and it's actually really quiet here, so quiet. We've gone down a little walk trail and it's looking lovely. We've got some more open areas on the left, flowers on the right, and a clear blue sky. It's just so quiet. We just about didn't need to go to Muck and Budden to go wildflower hunting because look what we have here. So many different types of flowers. So pretty. I've never been down this path before. I actually have no idea where I am. I thought I was going to go to the Ken Street Weir, but this is heading in the wrong direction, I'm sure of it. Oh, we'll have to see. I'll go a little bit further down, and then if not, we can always turn around and go back. So we've had a quick check. Um, because I was starting to wonder whether or not we're going in totally the wrong direction for the Kent Street Weir. Um, but it turns out that it just does a bit of a slight detour and then connects to the path, um, the one that I'm familiar with. So, phew, we're not headed to Timbuktu. Oh, whoop whoop for that matter. <laughs> yeah, so that's good, good news. It's just going to take us a little bit longer to get there. But hey, we've got all day. What does it matter? This boardwalk goes over some wetlands, which right now, being spring, it's not very wet. But in winter, this is all one big puddle. Can you hear that? There's a little bird in that tree. Let's see if I can zoom in. Oh, it's flown away. Oh, there's another one. Where is it exactly? There it is. I have to say, this video footage is not doing it justice how beautiful it is. In real life, the flowers stand out so much more. And the sun on my skin is just so warming and lovely. Yep, it's definitely better if you can get out yourself, but the next best thing is seeing it on a video, I suppose is a wooden bridge that goes over the river and then just beyond we have maybe this is more like swampland stuff because up ahead is the actual weir just over there one of my little ones thinks they're going to fill up their water bottle here but i'm trying to discourage it look what we have here i think it's a moorhen Good. 
It's great how it's not scared of me. Seems totally undisturbed by me being only maybe two or three meters away. Which is great. I get a nice up close view. So this is a very popular spot and being a school holidays even more than usual there's that cafe just beyond the bushes you get quite a few kayakers and canoes come up here actually i've seen before when i've come on a saturday um, can be quite busy different kayaking clubs canoeing clubs yeah it's got a great vibe this place so I got myself a chai latte at the cafe behind me. I was tempted by a smoothie, but uh, they cost $10. So I was like, mm, no, I can get a chai for five. And sitting down to drink it. Then I've got to go back the way I came and get my little kids home before, before the day gets too late and they start getting grumpy. You don't want that. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching everybody. See you again soon.